I'm Yasuo Deguchi, I'm the professor of philosophy at Graduate School of Letters, Kyoto University. And I'm also the vice provost of Kyoto University. By working on the Asian philosophy from contemporary analytic perspectives. And that kind of uh, study, I call it as uh, uh, analytic Asian philosophy. So that is my current research topic. When I was a high school student, I read simultaneously two books on the same era of Japanese philosophy. And what is about yes, archaeological study. The other is sort of, uh, yes, more, more traditional examination of the document. And I was so fascinated about different approaches, different uh, methodologies, quite different result uh, on the just same era, same timing of Japanese society. But this part is basically my part of my research on the philosophy of science. So I interested in the very, very foundation of science. So what is the foundation of science? For me, that's an experiment or a measurement. In that measurement, that, that field is, called, is now called precision measurement. So optics is very important. So light is a very good measure or device. And that's why I studied some you know, principle of optics. For example, this is a very famous textbook of that, translated in Japanese. This part is a part of my Buddhistic study. And uh, this is a famous Daizokyo, that is a Mahayana Buddhistic canon that was edited and published in early 20th century Japan. And now is a sort of a standard book for the Buddhistic studies everywhere. So this you know, collection of Daizokyo are actually my grandfather's collection. And I borrowed that from my grandfather's house or library in my parents' house. And here is a sort of a Dogen uh, volume collection of uh, Dogen. Dogen is a 13th century Japanese Zen master. Also, for me, one, he's one of the best Japanese philosophers ever. Uh, and his philosophical insight is very, very sharp and deep. And I recently really enjoyed reading Dogen. And I tried to interpret Dogen in a quite strange contemporary philosophical way. My long-standing idea about how to do philosophy is just to establish my own philosophy. So I studied okay, many things, Kant and the contemporary philosophy of science. But for those studies, whenever I'm working on those studies, I always thinking to establish my own ideas. That's the key of my entire career. That's Kant's first critic. That, 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 yes, something like oh. this. So I devoted my five years in my twenties only on this book. Uh, it took five years to understand that and to have a sort of a critical viewpoint on entire kind of philosophy.